Ben and Ryan back at you again. We have another great video for you. We're going to get into some details about the highway project and what we got going on. And uh, highway yeah. slash freeway. Highway slash freeway. Can I do that? No. I can't. If I was directing a plane, it'd be real bad. <laughs> Where do I go? What does th what, what 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 does this mean? This means nothing. Jesus. Pull forward and park. Then say that. So stay tuned, guys. So we had R and B reptiles. Uh, we picked up a few animals over the years, and um, this girl's just like she hasn't. Uh, gotten to size to produce any eggs yet, but she is big enough now and she's breeding. So we are excited. And this is a gravel female. And what can you make with a gravel female, Ryan? Uh, if I can get her to... Whoop. <laughs> make tons of things with a gravel female. Well, what are we talking about here? Mm. Um, so obviously... You can make highways like this. This is the Enchi Highway. Highway is a combination of yellow belly and gravel. It is an allelic gene that makes a ALS acts like super. Mm -hmm. So anything that you put this to, whether it be gravel or yellow belly, you're not going to be able to tell the difference because gravel and yellow bellies look almost the same. Uh, but you can also put this with another gravel and make super gravels, which are awesome dark animals mm -hmm. And then you'll know everything is definitely gravel Yep And the gravel is a good base so and who do we have her pairing to right now her? Yep. She is being paired with uh, the jalopy Oh Man we have him going to a lot of stuff. So I'm gonna put her back and we'll show you the jalopy again and then we can talk about what that's gonna make. So to the gravel, we have the jalopy, which uh, has yellow belly in it. So we're excited to be making some crazy highways. Could make like six gene highway possible have pied combos. Yes. So that'd be cool. So I'm excited and I'm hoping that uh, that works out real well. This is him. He's a good, uh, good boy. Good boy. And who are we pairing to this girl? This girl is being paired up with the Enchi Banana Lori male. Do you want to grab him out? I will. Because I thought it would be interesting to see what a uh, yellow belly or gravel would look like in that banana Lori combo. Obviously, it can be super Enchi as well. Should be pretty neat. Yeah. So we showed him off not that long ago as well, but Enchi Banana Lori. This is me being stupid, but if Enchi and Lori are allelic, which we think might be, and this is Enchi Lori, then... And that's an Enchi Highway. We couldn't hit Super Enchis that are Lori as well. It's possible. It would either be super enchi, yellow belly, past no, there's no pasto. Super enchi, yellow belly, or gravel, or enchi, lori, yellow belly, ground with the banana as well. Yeah. So it's possible we would um, figure it out a little bit if we get an. Fact check me on that, guys. <laughs> if we get a super enchi lori, then we know that they're not allelic. If you yeah, it would yeah. So we would, would go by the head. That would prove it out whether it is or not. I mean, there I've seen probably five or six clutches that kind of line up with saying that they are. But if that's true, you can't have Super Enchi Lori. It will either be Enchi Lori or Super Enchi or... Yeah. 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 <clears throat> Love him, though. Anyway, that should be interesting to figure out. <laughs> we also have that pastel freeway coming in from Billy at Mutation Creation. Yes. Soon, right? 
I don't know. <laughs> Mid July. When we first bought them, it was in January. Female. Female. When we first bought her, it was in January um, of this year, and he was like, once it gets a little warmer, like mid March, I'll send him or send her. And March hit happened, and you guys all know what happened. So uh, he's been holding on to her and feeding her and doing well. And water's been closed, uh, pretty much. So yeah, I think we're that gonna get a, a breeder size adult female <laughs> in the mail. <laughs> so uh, yeah, we really appreciate that, Billy. Thank you for sending us uh, some cool stuff. And make sure you guys go check out his channel. Um, maybe you can see. Maybe I can I put a card in uh, up here somewhere where. Uh, we sent him masks. I thought it was pretty funny. Uh, anyway. So a project that we don't really talk about that much with you guys, and uh, I just realized it, we should probably update you on our lavender stuff. One animal that Ryan really wanted to uh, produce would be a dreamsicle. So what is a dreamsicle, Ryan? Dreamsicle is a lavender pied. Lavender albino pied. Oh, we recessive. We haven't produced one yet. And uh, we're gonna have a shot at it next year? Well, yeah, I guess it'll be next year. We have a pied 50% you know, pasta lab. that's just getting up to size. We also have the opportunity to make, we're making double heads and double heads with lots of extra genes in it, like Enchi and Leopard and Yellow Belly and Orange Dream. So mm -hmm. maybe the first Dream sickle we make will be like multi multi gene, multi multi gene. Mm -hmm. So these are two lavender albinos, and this is a het lavender albino female that, and these are all females, but uh, this het looked really, really good. So, and she's in shed and she still looks really good. I love her pattern, and sometimes you just, you know, you really fall in love with the normal looking snakes and they just have a little something different about them. And uh, this one is definitely one of those. So, we also have an adult lavender female and an adult het lavender female. Yeah. So, excited about this project. Show us your lavender albinos. Comment down below who has them. Yeah, Kai. Yeah, Kai. <laughs> Lucas Landon. This, this episode has been brought to you by Lucas Landon Royals. So, we're bringing these two along for the outro. Um, we really appreciate you guys watching. And, Ryan, what do you got there? Super Pastel Fire Calico Hidden Gene Woma. Fader Granite. Malum Odium. It is not a Malum or Odium. The rest, though, is true. Bald Gene. This might be Bald Gene. Look at that. Dorsal. Completely erased. Oh, hey. Calm down. And what I got is a girl that just laid for us. Um, which is our pastel lori. So I just want to show you guys how awesome and clean and beautiful. Look at this pastel lori. There's so much more that can be done. Um, we just saw Barchek just posted his super lori leopards. It was unbelievable. So really excited about this project. And uh, that was the Enchi banana lori melder. Yeah. Enchi Banana Lori Mail to the Pastel Lori. I think we got seven eggs from her in the incubator. Yep. Anxiously waiting, seeing our first Super Lori combos. Yep. That'll be awesome. Yeah. So thanks so much, guys, for watching the video. We really appreciate it. Make sure you smash the like button, subscribe, comment down below, share it with your friends. Watch Her Pals Rock. Please. Her Pals Rock. I feel like I'm begging a lot on Her Pals Rock. It's crazy because we have such great people on there. It's unbelievable. I, we have a vested interest in you watching it, but it, it is good information. We're not getting paid to uh, have her pal rock on. It doesn't make any money at the moment. At all. At all. And we're just having a ton of fun. You know, we have some really big, important, cool, crazy, smart people on. Like, it's unbelievable. Greg Graziani, Warren Booth. We're about to have Potter and Bob Ashley. I mean, real OGs in that her hobby. So, this can't go sideways at all kind of no probably <laughs> so thank you guys so much and i hope that ryan gets bit Woo! i'm working on it I hope that you don't let her bite my face in my face <laughs> see ya thanks
Are we still doing it? I don't know. We don't have to say it. We so do thing. <laughs> Let me put on my job helmet. <laughs> Always sunny in Philadelphia. Come on. <laughs> You're gonna sit and palpate with me watching right in front of you. Ah! <laughs> Just poked me in the jimmy. Enchi Lori bananas. Bananas. B a n a n a s. And then and so what's are you doing? What is it? Tying a bit of stuck shed that I need to handle. Because there's an eye cap. I didn't see it until just now. We can talk about why it's important to not let that happen because you can get scale damage underneath and you don't want to do that. Especially if it's an eye cap. The poor thing could lose its eye. So always take care of your animals. If you notice something like that, I might have to soak her to get the rest off her head, but I got the eye cap off. Might cut all that. <laughs> all right. See? Eye cap. Eye cap, ooh ha, ha Dog, they're starting to run. We gotta talk about them. You were talking and you stopped. Because if I didn't know what you were doing. This, this episode has been brought to you by Lucas Landon Royals. He pays us to say Guys, this. Guys, don't get all salty. We make up the sponsors. We're just <laughs> joking around. It's not true. It's gotta be fun for us too. It's not true. Sometimes they are real sponsors, but most of the time not. I mean, they, you can't really think that Doritos sponsored us. Yes, yes, actually Doritos did sponsor. <laughs> Hasbro did not sponsor us. <laughs> it would be awesome. Uh, Homestar Runner did sponsor us. Thank you very much. Okay. <clears throat> Unless you want to talk about something else. I don't want you belching in my face. For sure. It's gonna, I had tuna for dinner. It's going to oh smell my. terrible. It wasn't dinner. It was like a late, late lunch. You put nine and I have on As you should. If this isn't a fader, I'm like it. Is. You almost got bit. I know. I'm I, sure. I know. I saw her. Yeah, that's funny. This one. These guys have been on me since day one. Mm-hmm. Dang it. She just tried to strike you again. Really? Yeah. Mm. She just tried to strike you again. You're so far away. <laughs>